Hello Mentors, in this video we will learn how we can upload our app to Play Store. So how we can do that, we will see you step by step. So just type your Google Play Console and enter and you will get your play.google.com website console and click on that Google Play Console and you can see that's a website here and we need to click on go to Play Console, click on this. Now you have to log in with your Google account. So let me just log in. After sign up, you can see your that type of form. So you need to put your like public developer name. So let me just put your form to be. Just put my email address. And then you have to put your contact and phone number. And then you have to accept. Then accept and then click on create account and pay. And you can see, yes, you have to put your plus sign plus your country code so 91 is my country code so click on create account and pay and you will get that type of form like you have to put your card number and you have to pay the 25 dollar one time fees it means whenever you pay for 25 dollar you can upload unlimited app in your play store so play store will not charge you again so you have to just pay this 25 dollar one time yeah if this $25 is too much for you, so what you can do here, you can make a group of your friend and divide this amount to four or five friend. So it will cost you only $5. So you can do this. So let me just pay this amount. After completing the payment process, you will redirect here, play console dashboard. So we need to create your app. So in the right side, you can see your create app. So we just need to click on create app. And then I have to put my app name. So I am to upload your my ball eating game so i'm just put your the ball 80 that's my app name and the default is english app or game so it's a game and you can choose app if you have app or if, because we are uploading your game so that's why it's just game free or bad it's totally free and declaration years confirmation and confirm and then create app now you can see scroll down and you will get your provide information about your app and set up your store listing. So click on view tasks and you can see the app access. So click on this and all functionality is available without spatial access. Yes. Then save and then go back. Then we need to set up next thing is ads. So click on this. If your app contain the ads, so make sure you have to select this one. There's no harm with selecting this option. Okay. You don't need to worry anything. If you have ads in your app so please select this one uh, because there's no ads in my wall eating game so that's why i selected this one no and save and then go back and we have another process like content rating content rating and then start questionnaire and then wait some second and get the email address so we are going to put my email address again then category so the category is reference new or education educational or like game so that is our game this one game and then next then violence no fear no 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 language no 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 you have to make sure uh, be careful about that read all these things and then you can select the options okay and then no and then we just need to click on that save and then next and then we need to click on submit button see you've done now we need to go to the back again to dashboard and you can see we have completed three steps now click on target audience select this and then our target audience is 13 15 16 17 and 18 and over and then we need to click on next and then could your store listing unintensely appeal to children no and then next and then save now go to the dashboard again and you can see four steps complete news app click on this no this is not a news app and then save go back and then you can see the covid contact tracing and status app no this is not my app and save it and then go back and then select an app category and provide contact details so click on that select app category and app or game so game category is like uh, action adventure 
like so it's just like a uh, you can say the role playing game or adventure adventure or action okay and then manage tag so click on manage tag and you can just select your type your action so it's a game like action game apply and you have to put email address i'm going to put my email address here coding blogs at the rate gmail.com phone number is not necessary phone number or website you don't need to put and then just save it now what we need to do here now go to the dashboard again and now you can see set up your store listing so click on this and you can see your app name is bolly team sort description so i already have something in description like uh, using this game you can destroy the enemies and then copy paste this in the full description i'm to use this again and i'm to use some hashtag like uh, ball eating game and like the coding was something like this and then scroll down and you can see the app icon so you have to create app icon i'm using your canva to create this i already have created this so let me just show you how to look play store and you can see this uh, icon i have created and this size is 500 512 into 512 so make sure you have to create this dimension and try out this it will look like this cool and then you can see feature graphic so this feature graphic size is 1024 by 500 pixels so you can create the custom size image using canva so after this i'm going to drag and drop this image here i already have created this and drag and drop this then you can see the video so i have the uh, demo of that app so i'm going to use your this video link okay and let's go to here and paste it like this now phone is screenshot so i already have some screenshot of my game so both screenshots i'm going to rename both here so make sure this thing in like a screenshot one or a screenshot two something like that cool now we have to upload both screenshot here drag and drop this here yeah it's done now go back and you can see the tablet no i don't have it's not necessary okay so back and just save it done change this is done now go back to the dashboard again and you can see all tasks is completed and what we need to do here we need to click on publish your app on play store google play so click on that view task and you can see the select countries and regions so click on this and then add countries and then we have to select all countries and then add countries to region add cool now we need to click on the release dashboard and then click on that create new release and you can see the app bundle so we have to upload dot aab file so for that we have to open our that app inventor platform because we are getting our all apps using this platform so make sure you have to export the aab file android app bundle so select this wait some seconds so we can see we have dot aab file click on download done so that's our file here we have to upload that aab file so just try and drop this and upload it here wait some seconds generate your a app signing key uploading done uploaded now release name is one it's fine release note or you can just say uh, first first version or something like that and then we need to click on save and now we need to click on review release and warning so just ignore this warning and then click on that start rollout to production and rollout that is fine now what you need to do it's in review you can see the in review it means it takes some time like sometimes it takes 4 hours sometimes time it takes like around 24 hours to publish your app in play store so that is really easy process to upload your app in play store so if you have some doubt so just comment on the video i'll try my best to solve your problem thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe my channel like this video and share this video have a nice day be safe bye bye